do into our newsroom. It's the season of shortages and we're not talking about holiday gifts arriving on time. New York Blood Center announcing an emergency amid the Omicron variant and as nationwide shortages continue. So let's get right out to News 12 reporter Phil Tate. He's in Borum Hill with more on this. Phil. Yeah, well, Christy, the holidays are here and donating blood might not be at the top of everyone's seasonal to-do list. Well, the New York Blood Center telling us that their blood supply of inventory has dropped from five to seven days to one to two days worth of supply. And well, now they are urging New Yorkers to step up and to donate. Please come and support. We need every person that can come to support a blood drive. We just don't have enough right now to support area hospitals. The New York Blood Center telling us shortages have been caused by multiple factors, including the Omicron variant that now poses another threat to upcoming blood donations. They tell us cancellations are already rolling in from both individual donors and organizations hosting scheduled blood drives. Now this all on the heels of widespread fear since the start of the pandemic amid COVID-19 and as its effects are still being seen today. Many across our region still working from home, preventing organizations to host successful blood drives. Also, most high schools and colleges have not returned to hosting blood drives, which made up 25% of New York Blood Center's donations. Right now, the supply isn't there for hospitals, and they are having to pull back on certain procedures that they may have to, to treat people. So there's just not enough blood to go around. That's why we need more people to come and support. On average, even pre-pandemic, only 2% of the population donates on a regular basis. If we had one more percent of people donating, there would never be a shortage. Definitely a lot to think about there. And if you're wondering how long it would take you in your busy day just to donate, well, Christy, it only takes one hour. Now we're here in Borum Hill, Phil Tate, News 12. Yeah, it's no trouble at all. So anyone who can donate, please do. Phil, thank you for.